Uh, so let's go into the tutorial. So I'm gonna so so so. Uh, I'm gonna do like this 3D stroke ring when he shoots, and then it's like uh, like it's uh, it ah it's so hard to explain. Like it gets like five three circles after each other <laughs> okay but well, I will just run previews so you can check it out uh, I haven't seen this uh, on YouTube so I thought I would make one yeah uh, while this is loading okay, be sure to like the video is down there thank you so okay almost done uh, as you see when the like the circle uh, wait you will see it like that I think that's pretty good like I like this effect um, yeah so let's go into it so I'll just delete the 3d stroke and I will keep my color correction. It's the color correction that I used in my CC pack uh, V2. The second one, create second one, or the create two. Uh, yeah. And then on the clip, the only thing I have done is when it shoots, when the muscle flash is coming, I just keyframe to 100 to 2, so it's super slow. Uh, so yeah, that's what everything I've done so yeah I will just go and make a new solid I just make yeah uh, doesn't matter what color and then just search 3d stroke 3d stroke and then put it below the adjustment layer or the CC I can just rename this okay uh, and then on the presets you wanna oh you wanna Go and take basic circle. So now we got a circle. Um, oh, not loop. Okay, what you want to do is just go to the where is it camera, and you wanna drag the zoom to about where you want it to. So about there, like 600. Uh, maybe a little bit less. Right there. And you want to keyframe where he shoots, so the muscle flash, like there. Just keyframe one, two, three, four. Oh, basically, we go one, two, like 20 frames, I think it's good. Maybe 25, I don't know. And just drag this up so you does not see it anymore. Like, yeah just drag it up um yeah so now you wanna uh, highlight the keyframes and ec stem and then enable the motion blur so now the we have like the whole thing basically but there's a ring here and we want we don't want that so what you want to do is just go one keyframe before uh, it actually starts so there and then you want to set the zoom to zero right it just so it disappears and then like bam Yeah, probably drag this keyframe in a bit. Yeah, but yeah. So we will just get going. Uh, and by the way, um, as you see, I haven't added any glow or anything to this, and it's just pretty nice glow. But we'll get to that later. Uh, so yeah, you want to go to re repeater, repeater, and you want to click enable, and you want to set the instances to two, opacity like eighty, I would say, 
and then scale this is basically uh, you get like uh, wait you want to go to the first keyframe like the or the second keyframe so it would be wait. shit okay there we go uh, and you want to put the scale to the same like wait you want to put the scale to like this if that makes sense uh, you want to keyframe that when everything is like um, white like when everything looks like a circle so then you want to keyframe and go to the last keyframe and you want to uh, drag the scale up to pretty much so if we drag this through it's like many many strokes coming so that looks pretty good so now you just click U again and highlight these keyframes and ease them. So now we're gonna keep or add the whole it's, uh, the effect itself, basically star glow, trap code star glow, and you wanna drag it on. And basically, you see here, I get this nice, nice sweet. Uh, um, like color correction or uh, glow on my uh, circles but I'm just gonna change a few things like street strength light 15 but if you don't like the uh, like the colors on the stroke you can go to color map a and change whatever here is midtones and change colors and color map B so that's basically it okay so we're almost done actually like bam looks pretty cool i think so i always keep or ramp preview this one last time so yeah i think this is a pretty unique uh effect i haven't seen that pretty much but you can do so much better with this effect this is just the basics so yeah, bam. Uh, to make the repeater like more circles, you can just drag the in things to like how many you want. And now it's like, bam. But it will, your computer will lag pretty much. So I'm just gonna keep it two. And then, um, you can change some other stuff too. Yeah, it's so much stuff you can change, but yeah. I'll just, uh, um, yeah, I think we're done right now. Um, leave your tutorial request in the comments below. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and uh, leave a like and a comment below and yeah, thank you.